Hey guys, Phoenix here, back with more Penny Arcade. Talking to Dr. P. Wimple, because I just killed a bunch of hobos. Oh, hello, hello. Uh, we have uh, directed uh, the hobos to seek greener pastures. Oh, at any rate, less yellow ones. Indeed, indeed, then payment is in order. Gather round, gather round. Arnold opens the park gate and then ushers you in. Arnold makes a great show of excavating his pockets with obvious delight. Before you can recoil, he deposits a, deposits a bizarre punch card. Monkey card. This odd little punch card has a monkey on it for some reason. A crumple ticket. This tarot ticket allows entry to Pelican Bay, New Arcadia's perverse boardwalk district. And a wad of lint. This is some lint. What's the card for? What's the card about exactly? Yes, the promised card. Of course, my days beside the ring are long over. Not much good to non-scientists, I suppose. But curiosity at best. Nell's mind seems to drift off into space. Perhaps time. Perhaps. Perhaps I've said too much. Is this lint? Yes, unfortunately. That was an accident. You may keep it, however. Tell me about this awesome ticket you gave us. That ticket will grant you one family access to the Pelican Bay Boardwalk. You don't need it? Sadly, I am no longer allowed in the venue. My attempts to uh, research the sin wheel have not been especially well received. Well, thanks. Thanks for all the stuff. Cool. And now I can go to Pelican Bay. Because now I have the ticket to get in. Because you can't buy tickets. You can only get them. God damn. Those whistle sound effects. Also, I need to get that, pin that wheel eventually. Could a swindle, repeatable vendor, despite what you may have heard, or even directly experienced? We have a ticket now, was it? Yeah, but that's a family ticket. We send those special tickets to loving families. Surely don't expect me to believe that you lot are related to one another. That guy is some kind of hairy half-man. And this guy over here is some kind of albino marmot. I don't even know how to describe you. Which is the joke, because you can customize your character. We are related as fuck! We were just doing some family shit. People in our family are generally well armed. I, I see. We tend to carry machine guns. I, yes, I, I see that. We can also punch people really hard. Yes, really hard. I understand. Like, bam. Curse Widow, reputable vendor, fumbles inside his kiosk core button. The gate to Pelican Bay is now open. I can't bear all these savings. I must flee. Yes, yes, I can't enough currents. You'll be back. Oh, yes. Draws my bargains like I'm off to a... Uh, to a... Uh, to a bargain. Anyways. Oh, no. The mimes. All right, this is a good mime. This is a... Uh, Dr. Mime, right. You see a mime conspicuously garbed in a lab coat. He's going through some kind of stuck-in-a-box thing with precision and... Gravity of a religious act. Suddenly he seems to take notice of you. Oh, thank God. Someone who's in a fucking lunatic. Well, I wouldn't be so hasty. So don't tell me. Oh, look. Another person who needs help. I'm trying to work up the courage going there, actually. Back into the boardwalk. When I left, I had to leave quickly. And quietly. Well, yeah, that makes sense. Like, for your people. Left behind three tools I need if I ever want to mime again. Regular mime, not mur murder the entire universe mime. They've no doubt passed my shit amongst themselves now. My invisible rope, invisible pre briefcase, and invisible stairs. How would we find those? How are you sure you don't have this stuff? Right, I mean, why don't you just pretend you have it back? I could do you one better, actually. Gabriel makes a show of handing the mime three impossibly large objects. There you go. 
it's clear you just don't get it. Try this on the next mine you see, asshole. Then come here with your stand-up fucking comedy. He throws you something and somehow you catch it. So what's your deal? You just hang out, miming up? I need help. I need it so bad. We get this lot. Not like this, you don't. This may come to surprise to you, but I was once a mime. No way. No, it's true. I serve their dark god, bringing huge spots on this place and there's a new domain. There's a mime gone? If you want to register a cult legally, you have to have a dark god. It's like the first blank page on the form. Hideous deity. I didn't know it was also official. Their god power grows in silence. Reaching its apex is when he devours the universe and all things become still in his belly. The other minds are obsessed with bringing the silent one into being on this plane. So this is my favorite joke in this game. Is that there's this whole um, Lovecraftian god, the, a god of silence, who is being worshipped by a cult of mimes. And that just always makes me smile thinking about how good that joke is. I, I, I like it so much. I really do. And listen, you have to understand, it wasn't always like this with the mimes. It used to be all measuring lampposts and, oh no, a box! That's all before they found the book. Tycho is visibly shaking. The book. Right. The book that revealed every mime's true service, their deeper calling. The Necrowambicon. You sound kind of cute munchkin on the cover. Don't be fooled by that, fooled by that shit. We did 666 birthday parties to fund it. Bar expedition to the mysterious East claimed the dark prize. Bunny. I, this is so. I love the mimes in this. We've had the Necrowambicon in, in for study at the old academy. That's some tome of forbidden mime lore. It's completely blank. That book is the biggest hoax in the history of apocalypse. 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 I assure you, it's no hoax. The book may be gone, but power is not. Even now, they work throughout the city, consummating its profane commandments. It's too bad, too. I'm actually very fond of existence. They're trying to. And you're hanging around with these guys. Why again? It was like a peer pressure thing. You know how it is. I was at this party once. I almost started worshipping their elemental form of evil. I just want to be cool, you know? So when they started passing around that cursed idol. Alright. So, yes. Evil God. What could be done? Oh, you can't stop it. It's impossible. Their God is the dark hush of every night. He's the other quiet of a casket sealed in a mountain tomb. So you told about this, this because... I don't know. Just making conversation, I guess. Bye. The x mine waves at you. A gigantic, exaggerated wave like a beauty queen from the deck of a ship. It's a wave with a quiet power. Cool. Oh, I seriously thought this was a, a cult circle for a second. No, that's just a compass. Stop me if you heard this one. Oh no, clowns! Oh god. Oh god. Not clowns. Get her off. Your ass off the boardwalk, Pinky. <laughs> Did he just bleed green behind him? Please tell me you punch clowns. Oh my god, he's bleeding all sorts of colors. Oh, they're not weak to anything. He, is he flicking me off? He's flicking me off! Oh boy. Okay, um. Oh yeah, that's a lot harder. 
and does like no damage, but does stun him. This is actually pretty nice music. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, that's really complicated. Uh, pay attention, pay attention, pay attention! Okay. Since it was a crit, I really had to pay attention so I didn't take a lot of damage. I actually do like this song, it's really cool. One dead clown. I'm jamming out to this song, it's... Oh, I don't even know what he just did. Did he just give me a very violent blowjob? That's what it looked like. I don't know. Oh, that was a lot of experience. Ooh, bombs. Explosive clown nose. 160 damage. Full tile. Clown parts must be handled with care. So those bombs are really useful against the um, robots. Uh, flying pricks, aim at the balloon with the mouse, throw, click to throw darts. Oh, wow. And then I get a red token for that, cool. Can I just keep doing this for more red tokens? Haha. Uh, oh, the green one got in the way. Oh, there is a time limit? Okay. So yeah, you can just farm red tokens here. Cool. I need four red tokens. I green is good, right? Because it's uh, one of those things I can trade for takes three, the other one takes one. So I need a nice chunky four. So one more. So this is interesting watching me play carny games. It's like a freaking flash game. Oh my god. Okay, that should be four. Pop, 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 etc. Oh, where's the robots? There's supposed to be like 400 robots in this. Oh, uh, there's some milk. I wasn't expecting that. Robots! Uh, just two? Oh, they have so much health! Yeah, I'm not going to get the achievement for winning a fight. Only by counterattacking anyone. It's much too late. I've ruined it. Cause like these guys have so much health and counterattacking only does damage damage. Are you fucking kidding me? Burn in hell. Like, 
seriously burn. I wasn't paying attention to the block, and you, they apparently one shot me. So, oh my god. Full heals? That's not a thing, that should be a thing! I don't need to see if this does anything. Attacks or not. I didn't even see that happen. Oh, no. Bandage me, please. While I'm waiting for the sweet embrace of death. Oh god. Distract him, please. Fuck the fruit. Oh god. Oh yeah, that looks sounds. Missed. Shit. Oh god, I'm going to lose against generic enemies again. Probably should not play it on the hardest difficulty first. Oh, oh my. I don't know. These guys are so strong. Yes, I want to fucking continue. Try that again. So they're actually weak to Maltas, but not exploding count clown noses. Which is a very important distinction. And there's the full heal. Super fun. Jesus Christ. Well, at least I got one back for doing this. Uh, new one for Tycho. More targets hit in the same amount of time, but now can shoot a full gas can out of the air to rain all over, to rain over your enemies. Hit all targets for maximum damage. So is that AoE? Because oh, now I need to start um breaking shits. And I also don't... Hmm. Get real quick. Upgrade my rake. Yes, absolutely. I can have the maid take it to the street with the other garbage. I should do my best. It's a slightly better rake now. Okay, so next is not until after quite a while. Back to Pelican Bay. Clowns! Oh, did the box lady send ya? Box lady? Was there supposed to be an attack? It sounded like they were going to attack, but then they didn't, so now I got confused. Yeah, he's just flicking me off again. Uh, he's literally just biting your deck. Boom, boom, boom. Nope. 
Normal one. <laughs> Make it easier on me. Boom! He explodes! And he, his dead body flicks me off. Nice. Yeah, just keep being the shit out of him. There he is, flicking me off again. What did I ever do to you? It's not like I just killed your brother or something. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. How? Um, punchy punchy, and overkill, and there it is, boom, exploding, flick you off, I got more exploding clown noses, nice, 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 could always use more of them. What was this? It's like fudge! Never eat something that's only like fudge. Ugh. Anyways, that's enough for this episode. If you like the video, do the thing that does the thing, lets me know about the thing. And until next time, bye bye.